I'm so honored to introduce our next guest. In over four decades in the music business, he has achieved great success in a whole lot of ways. You've heard his work in movies like Father the Bride and in renowned orchestras throughout our nation. Not to mention, he's a Grammy award-winning vocalist that has sold thousands of albums and gained a passionate following all over the world, folks. Let's now welcome jazz great Steve Tyrell. Thank Hello, you for my coming darling. on Prime Yeah, I'm a, you forget, I'm gonna give you oh, a kiss. Yo, I'm gonna knock you chair. over, huh? You see that? He made me nervous. I just you grabbed you. Nervous. I just you grabbed make, you. You made me nervous. <laughs> All right, you've got a big hit right now. Let's talk about that. Well, I have this new album. It's called It's Magic, The Songs of Sammy Kahn, who's one of the great songwriters of all time. I mean, he, he wrote 87 Frank Sinatra songs. He's celebrating his centennial this uh, June 18th. So I thought it'd be great to do an album at, of, of his music and his songs. Um, he was nominated 27 times for wow. the Oscar. He's one of the great songwriters of all time. So it's a whole album of Sammy Kahn songs, and it debuted on the Billboard chart this week at number two. Well, congratulations. <laughs> you deserve it. Well, I, I don't know if I deserve it, but yeah, I'm happy about it. Yeah, you do. How long did this take to come into fruition? When did you start working on this? Uh, last year. Last year. That's you know, not when very I saw long. You, it takes about a year to make an album, usually. And, but I you mean, you can make it in one day, but you know, you just keep trying different You're songs. You're cultivating and stuff. it. Yeah. Oh, what, that's ones. awesome. So proud of you. So I'm you, proud of you too, baby. So you played, let's tell the viewers, like all the great people that you have performed with. Because we've got uh, Ray Charles, Diana Ross, LL Cool J, right? Well, those are people I wrote songs with and uh -huh. produced, you know. I've, I've, uh, I didn't perform ever with Ray Charles, but I produced his records. Okay. And he did songs that I wrote. And uh, LL and I had worked on his movies. And it was, and we, he and I wrote. What do you do? Of, so you wrote with. I, I did a lot of work in films for years. Right. I mean, that's you know, music for lots of different films, and I sang in lots of them, and, and but a lot of times I and television too. Like I, I go all the way back to WKRP in Cincinnati. I did the music for that. You know. Wow, I remember that show. Yeah, that was <laughs> fun. They had a reunion recently, but I, that's what I did. I did music and produced artists. Found it from behind the scenes, mm -hmm. and then uh, after you know, people would use my s stuff sometimes in the movies or on television or whatever. And then Father the Bride, I sang the way you look tonight, and it kind of changed my life. I started doing standards albums, and when nobody was doing them, and this is my tenth one. And uh, then Rod Stewart heard my album and asked me to produce him doing the Great wow, American Songbook. Wow, I love Rod Stewart. Well, I produced his first number one album in 25 years. He's one of my dear friends. And I produced three Rod Stewart albums that, uh, that did one him a Grammy and me too. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh. And you know, so that was my real job and now I'm just. Give us a little background about you. When did you get interested in music? Before always, you were big time. Always, always. When I was a kid, you know, I just, I would, I wanted to be a drummer, so I was. I used. I used to love the way a coat hanger made a hi hat sound like. Tss, 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 tss. <laughs> and I used to. Beat I bet you dro drove your mother crazy. I did. I used to beat in the back of the car on that thing, and and I just always loved music, and I always was interested. And in I've never done anything else, and probably couldn't, you know. I bet you broke a lot of hearts with that, with your music, your sultry voice, right? Oh, I don't know. About <laughs> that. You're, you're the heart I want, baby. <laughs> Nobody better look at me. Well, you. Oh my well, God! You here. see, you made my. Thing I know fall that's off. okay. Let it fall. But you're in San Diego <laughs> you didn't for shake a reason. Me up too bad. You're in San Diego for a reason, for a really good cause. Let's right. talk about the charity events that, that you're going to be performing. The American at. Cancer Society mm -hmm. is is honoring Papa Doug on Sunday night. Our dear friend, mm -hmm. and uh, I'm going to come in and sing for it. And I'm thrilled. You know, I've been very close to a lot of causes, and you know cancer. My, my wife of 26 years and the mother of my children died of cancer. And uh, so I, I try to do as many things that I can to help out that cause for mm. sure. It's like the plague that cancer is in this it world. It is. It know. is. Well, we thank you for coming down for that. What a great event and what a great charity. And the UT has um, you vow to raise over a million dollars for cancer research, which is great. Well, great. And whenever yeah. you need a little, you know, a singer, yeah. we'll you be just calling call him. out my name. <laughs> and you know wherever I am. Keep I'll going. We're going to get more of this. We're going to listen again. to his hit when he comes yeah. back. Keep yeah. going. Keep going. Well, that's James Taylor's song. Keep going. Keep singing. Or Carol King's song, actually. <laughs> yeah. Winter, spring, summer, or fall. <laughs> 
All you got to do is call, and I'll be there. Yes, I will for you, Taylor, my darling. <laughs> we'll be right but back. you got a friend. Hey, welcome back. We're here with jazz great Steve Tyrell talking about his latest hit, It's Magic. The songs of Sammy Kahn. So talk about the songs. Well, Sammy Kahn is, uh, like I said earlier, one of the great songwriters of all time. I mean, he was born in 1913 and in, in his and he was playing the violin by the time he was 14 and already writing songs. And over the, his songs have been recorded by everybody from Frank Sinatra who did 87 of his songs, and Nat King Cole and Elle Fitzgerald and Dean Martin and all the people back in the day, mm -hmm. all the way to Amy Winehouse, myself, Rod Stewart, you know, Michael Buble named an album after him. So he was, he's one of the true greats. And uh, I think his music is really relevant to this particular time mm -hmm. because Taylor, there was a period like from 1958 maybe to 62 where everything changed in pop culture. People used to sleep in twin beds, you remember, on, and Father Knows yep. Best and all this stuff. Then all of a sudden there was the Rat Pack and I remember you know, the Playboy Rat Magazine. Well, I don't remember it, I know of it. Well, he wrote all yeah. the songs for that period. All right, you know? well, we're going we're gonna to hear... You're going to perform some of the songs when we come back. And we're going to be right back. Okay, you're going to perform some of the songs from your latest album, It's Magic. What are what is your favorite song? Uh, well, it's hard to say. I mean, come fly with me, kick in the head. There's so many great ones. There's like I said, what's your favorite kid? I don't have a favorite well, kid. You I have don't a favorite have a No, I wouldn't have 13 on there if I had only okay, like one. Okay, but you're you're picking fly away with me. Why? Well, the reason I Sammy Kahn was nominated 27 times for his mm -hmm. work writing for film, and uh, this is a song that a blue-eyed guy from New Jersey you may have heard of him at Frank. <laughs> he ate spaghetti. Uh, he, he, yeah, that yeah. guy. Anyway, this is a song from a movie with the same name. Oh, shall we perform it? Or you'll perform it? I, I would. Take if it I can, away. If I Let's can go. look at you while I'm doing it. <laughs> You see a pair of laughing eyes And suddenly you're sighing sighs You think there's nothing wrong You string along, boy, then snap Those eyes, those sighs They're part of the tender trap You're hand in hand beneath the trees Soon there's music in the breeze You're acting kind of smart Until your heart just goes whap Those trees, that breeze They're part of the tender trap Some starry night When her kisses make you tingle She'll hold you tight and you'll hate yourself for being single And all at once it seems so nice The folks are throwing shoes and rice You hurry to a spot that's just a dot on the map And you wonder how it all came about Well it's too late now Cause there's no getting out you fell in love, in love Is a tender trap Just like Taylor You're a tender trap Thank you Hey, can you take us to break? Keep singing, take us sure. to break Put right. something on and I'll sing <laughs> We just do oh, this is Take it away Say, I got a lot to learn Well, don't think I'm trying not to learn Since this is the perfect spot to learn Teach me tonight Starting with the ABC of it Right down to the XYZ of it Help me solve the mystery of it Teach me tonight 
You know the sky's a blackboard high above you If a shooting star goes by I use that star to write I love you A thousand times across the sky But one thing is a very clear my love Should the teacher stand so near my love Graduation's almost here my love Come on and teach me tonight Taylor, why don't you teach me? Oh, won't you teach me tonight? Yeah, Taylor, baby. I'd like a private lesson. <laughs> <laughs> 